FAST, an abbreviation for the 500 meter Aperture Spherical Radio Telescope. Looks like an aluminium wok. We're on our way up to have a sort of uh, bird's eye view over FAST. It's located in Guizhou, a mountainous province in southwest China. It is the biggest in the world, and I'll show you right now. FAST, a super large radio telescope with a diameter of 500 meters, almost twice as large as the 305 meter Arecibo radio telescope, which is the second largest in the world. Its huge diameter means that it has a greater sensitivity to receive signals from outer space. After its completion in 2017, the telescope has detected the pulsar signals from outer space many times, which will greatly enrich our understanding of the origin of the universe and human life. So we just took a uh, little bus about 20 minutes up really high to be able to overlook the telescope and oh my god it's absolutely huge you would have seen a picture that uh, somebody a security guy took of me up there it's fascinating to look at something that huge infrastructure project that's been you know planned for years and it's just there right in front of your eyes and it's 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 fascinating especially as it's the biggest one in the world The mountain area where FAST is located is about 140 kilometers away from Guayan, almost free from the interference of human activity signals. The area has typical karst landforms and the sunken limestone cave forms a natural sinkhole which can support the astronomical equipment and save considerable human and financial resources. Thus, it is the perfect location for the radio telescope. The reason it was built in a valley as vast as this one is because the project is so damn heavy that they needed some natural support. To improve the flexibility of the telescope, Chinese scientists independently developed an automatic reflector which can adjust the cable net structure to enable FAST to automatically capture signals from outer space. With the application of FAST, more and more Chinese and foreign scientists have come to Guizhou. FAST is not only an achievement of Chinese astronomical science and technology, but marks an important step in astronomical exploration of mankind. Behind this great project is a person worthy of respect. He proposed the idea of building FAST. In the museum that was specifically built for the man the legend, the pioneer of this entire project, Narendong. With anybody who wants to do something that's completely revolutionary, that they kind of get seen as crazy at first, and not many people see what they see, not many people can visualize what they are willing to go through to build something that is unlike any other. And this was the bloke, and he carried it through from 1993 all the way to when he passed away. Narendong first proposed the concept of FAST in 1994. In the following 12 years, Nan and his team screened out 391 suitable hollows in the mountains of Guizhou. <laughs> This trip to Guizhou not only offered me a splendid view of the massive telescope, but the legendary man behind it and his idea brought me the story of the scientist's initiative and vision of mankind's exploration of the universe into the future.